Hey, what is going on everybody? Danxiety here bringing you another Fortcraft video. And in today's video, I just want to go over the recent updates to the game and show you guys what has been going on. Uh, especially if you have not made it into the beta, um, this could be a way for you to keep up with the progress of the game because I'm sure you're going to be able to play in the near future. Um, I'm not sure. I can't give an exact time estimate of when they would open up the beta again, but... From playing, I can tell you that there are bots, 100% confirmed bots, in the game. So, perhaps it could be once they, you know, up their server cap, like, based on, like, you know, their uh, power and, like, spending. Um, maybe they can get more live players in there. Uh, I'm not too sure about all that stuff, but I just want to show you guys what's been going on. So, first, uh, we had yesterday, which was March 13th for me. Um, you had solo and duo both open. So you were able to play duo for the first time, and that was great. Uh, I have some screenshots. I was actually like the first ranked player in duo. Uh, duo. My name was Legend, and duo was a lot of fun. Uh, they have voice chat working, and you could have a little team uh, looking for group, looking for team type system in the game already, and you could add friends and talk to them. So those are all really, really positive strides right there. Uh, and they had some other uh, little bug fixes and stuff like that. And now today, uh, which is March 14th, 2018, we have a another update. And that update is adding squad mode. So squad mode has been updated and in, put into the game. Uh, however, they did take away duo mode. So now it's only solo and squad. So that's really good um, seeing how daily they're testing new things that definitely shows that these guys are monitoring what's going on each and every day so that's a very good positive outlook uh, they some minor changes they changed the name of Westlake to Lake Island um, I, I don't even know what that place was to begin with I gotta get more familiar with that map and they say they fixed the correct ID display showed in the battle results so uh, yeah, so that's basically what has been going on. Uh, I did win my first squad game as well as my first duo game and this game is Relatively easy as of right now. Uh, I can I can't tell if it's because the game is easy and Maybe since I played so much rules of survival the skill translated directly over but I have been winning a lot of games so if if I might if I have any tips I would be really happy to pass them on so I can definitely make a few videos on some tips such as uh, what I prefer to use as my quick build or how to aim better strafing uh, jumping all different types of strategies that can help you in this game what guns to use versus what guns to not use based on you know damage and uh, accuracy stuff like that so. I'd be happy to continue making videos on Fortcraft. So if you guys want to see that, just let me know and I will do that. So, and if you have any suggestions too, you can let me know as well. So that's going to do it for this video. Uh, I'm going to try to make videos like this as often as I can, showing you what is in the new updates. So hopefully I will see you guys tomorrow or the next day, whenever the next update comes back. And I'm going to give you another Fortcraft update. Thank you very much for listening and have a great one.